Now's the more complicated one, which was the double one. This was the one that people were getting a little bit confused about. So this is one you're going to need a cushion for this one to secure it to. I can't put a cushion on here because um, I haven't got room so it will stick out. So what I've used is my headband and I've attached my, let me show you, I've attached the seed bead, which is a bigger one this time. I've attached it exactly the same way as we did with the first one, is going through twice and then you end up with the two, two um, wires coming out. So again, it was a metre of wire. 100 centimeters and I've attached that there and that's going to be my anchor so first of all we asked you to design the beads so this one we're laying them horizontally so I'm gonna do it on this piece of paper here first right I want you to lay the beads so for every horizontal bead, you lay a seed bead in the middle of both. So there, there and there. I'm going to do a quick fast forward here. So once you've done that, what I want you to do is turn the piece of paper around. So hopefully you will have it attached to your cushion. Just something to secure it. Right, the first thing you want to do is take the left hand thread or your right hand, however, which way you're looking. We're going to go through the left. Take the right hand one. Oops, dropped it. And Go through the opposite direction. Through this side, take the other wire and go through in the opposite direction. Pull the both wires. You want to go up as far as you can to your seed beads. So I hope you can see that. I don't think you can. So I can pull this out. I hope you can see that. So the next thing is to put the red bead on. Pick it up. Put one the other side, tuck it up, get another paper bead, take the left hand side and go through, holding onto the bead, take the right hand side and go through in the opposite direction. Once you're through, pull both wires or thread, whatever you're using, and bring it up to the end. So take seed bead, spacer bead, can't see very well now. I hope you can see this okay. I hope this lighting is not too bad quite sunny outside so hopefully the lighting's good so again two spacer beads one either side take them up to the paper beads take a paper bead through left hand side hold the bead put it through right hand side and pull. Pulling both ends. It's beginning to look jolly nice actually. 
So as you can see, I've fast forwarded the, the video now. It's, um, it's repetitive, it's, it's just doing exactly the same. The two seed beads and the paper bead in the middle. So you continue till you've got it to the, the desired length of, of your wrist. Um, so I hope you're enjoying this. So carry on beading and uh, hope you're keeping well and um, staying creative. And I want to see your pictures. So send us in lots of pictures of what you're doing. Right, well I'm gonna I'm gonna finish that off there. I'm not gonna finish it, I'm gonna let you guys go off and start doing your beading. And um hopefully you'll do some actually lovely work and send in some pictures because that's what we want to see, what you're actually up to. And got any stuck on anything got any problems drop me a text i've got the mobile and um hopefully we'll be able to guide you through stuff but you can see from this how this is going to end up i hope looking quite lovely bracelet this one let me just take that off there and give you a closer look Right, so you can see how that's going. So I'll take that to the end. I need to salvage some more beads from here. So hopefully I can come to the end and um, I'll post a picture of how it, how it looks when it's completed. But again, if you haven't got findings, do this part of it. Do as much as you can. And um, we can finish them off in, in personal projects when we're, when we're back in, in the workroom. Um, I've got another little one here that I was playing with. This one is newspaper. And I've just put a, a pin on the back of it. So a little brooch. So you can do stuff like that as well. But um, yeah keep uh, keep beading see i've got a lovely selection here which i'll have to make something else out of i've got some lovely turquoise ones which they lend themselves to be a brooch i think one of my favorite colors but yeah keep well keep crafting keep drawing keep painting stay safe stay active Stay connected, be creative. Thanks for watching, guys. See you soon.